And now to breaking news out of Tennessee. Police have detained a person of interest in the case of a missing Memphis mom who was allegedly abducted on her run on Friday morning. News Nation's Marky Martin has been tracking this and has the latest on the investigation. Marky? Yeah, Natasha, Memphis police just tweeting out this. They have located a vehicle of interest and detained the man who was driving it. Now, the woman they're looking for has not been found. Authorities are searching for 34-year-old teacher and mother of two, Eliza Fletcher, who went missing after she did not return from her Friday morning run near the University of Memphis. Her water bottle and a cell phone found in front of a home on that route. Fletcher's family announced a $50,000 reward for any help in finding her. And they also released a video statement thanking police for their search efforts and saying Eliza has touched the hearts of many people. The family has met with police and we have shared with them all the information we know. More than anything, we want to see Liza return home safely. Just heartbreaking for this family. Also wanted to show you this. Surveillance footage shows an unknown man approaching her, forcing her into a dark colored SUV. Authorities released still photos of the vehicle and Fletcher in a pink sports bra and purple running shorts. That's the last thing that she was seen wearing, Natasha. We're also learning today Fletcher is part of a wealthy Memphis family. Her grandfather helped launch a $3 billion hardware company called Orgel uh, Incorporated. And now the search continues to find Fletcher. The FBI and TBI are assisting Memphis police and urge anybody with information on what could have happened to her to please come forward. Natasha. Yeah, so scary and terrible for her family. Marky Martin, thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.